Hey, what's up, guys? Second Creeper here back again with some more Portal 2 Workshop. Oh, yeah, so we left off. We completed Moon Base, Luna, C01, and O2. Now we're on to O3. One small step by Cat C. Let's do this thing. Might as well see how different things will be on the Moon Base so this time. I mean, I mean, the last couple times we were learning about how gravity works on the Moon Base, it's basically it's basically just Moon, basically just moon physics. So, uh, so, I mean, lighter gravity. Oh, aerial faith plates. Hmm. So we got aerial faith plates up here. Okay, so okay, that that springs me up pretty quickly. Oh, I just completely missed it. <laughs> That's hilarious. Uh, hmm. All right, so if I do that, okay, that happened. What what's going on over there? Hmm. Doesn't seem to be motion triggered. Or it doesn't seem to be jump triggered, so I don't get it. Hmm. So, eventual goal is to get there, but how? Hmm. I need to get over there somehow. Can I jump across? Maybe. Guess if I do that, I can get up here. Oh. Hmm. Okay. What does that drop? Does that drop a... Hmm. Does it... Hmm. Does it do anything? Ah! Cube! Nice. Good guess. Give me this. Okay. So, I need to get up there. Oh, I need to do so. Oh, God. Okay. It's a good thing. It's a good thing I can jump high. Okay, are you actually kidding me? There we go. So I need to get the cube over there somehow, but hmm. How would I do that? Yeah, how would I get the cube across this pit? Very good question that I do not have the answer to. So if I do this, I can I can get up here, bring the cube with me if I need to. I mean, all this does. This is just a little pit. I don't really understand why this pit needs to be here. But I need, I need to get the cube across this pit. What if I do this? I don't think that works. I really don't think that's going to work. So, what is that? Hmm. Might as well find out what that does. Alrighty, let's see what we got. So, oh! Okay, so that button... Or, no, it's... What? Wait, what? What good does that do? Oh, uh, what? So there's a there's a laser grid here. I cannot jump across. Uh, I cannot jump across without uh, with that laser grid active. So some button somewhere. It's up here. Hmm. I'm looking. Let's see. It's. I don't get it. Okay, so I may need to fling the cube differently, or I can't fling it over there at all. Wait, what was that? Hmm. Let's try flinging it differently. How about that? That is not going to make it. Okay, so... Cube cannot be flung. Which means I need to find some other way to get the cube over there. That's interesting. Wait a second. Hang on. Ah! Okay, that's how I get the cube over here. I'm... Okay. Okay, I will admit it. I... Uh, I did not see that. Oh, God. Okay, well... 
I need to do... I need to blue up here so that way I can just fall through and then land here. And that turns off the Emancipation Girl. Sweet! I can bring this with me. Oh, but then I need to, uh... That's, uh... That's something. How about I just, uh, put this over here? Like that. I like how... I like how gravity is reversed for, uh, for everything that goes through the Emancipation Grill. That's, that's fun. Okay, so I need to... Uh, I need to be able to get through here, uh, without losing a portal. Okay. So I need to do this. Well, get up. Thank you. All right. Perfect. So now I just use this. Soar across. And whoa. Okay. And I think I'm. I think I'm through. Yeah. This. This definitely looks like an uh, exit. Next test chamber this way. Yes. Perfect. So that is one small step. Though, if I'm being completely honest, I need to catch up on my uh, video schedule, so next chamber. That's all the time I have for now, but be sure to tune in to the next episode to see the next chamber in this session. Yeah.